my beautiful Sagittarians welcome to April career and finance readings this is the second time when I record your reading if the other video will recover my might be this a bonus or the other one if you see two videos for the career and finance this month no that was meant Mercury retrograde is quite strong this month so believe that certain things are definitely out there well, let's see left career and finance for my Sagittarius always always loves take what resonates and definitely leave what does not resonate Sagittarius I hope everyone does well and let's see we have five of Pentacles we have Queen of Wands. And I believe the other reading also starts with the Five of Pentacles. So there is something here that speaks about connection. Queen of Wands, here you are. The Temperance. It's kind of you are moving away. Five of Swords. I believe the other uh, the reading had the Five of Wands. But we have Five of Swords. So definitely here, whatever changes didn't happen for five years for some of you are going to happen within days. Let's see more. Look another card of yours. The Jupiter here, it's helping you to find your way out. Nine of Cups and Six of Swords. Definitely here, five and six movement forward from an energy. And I also have this hermit energy here. You are moving here towards a better energy, a more suitable energy. And yes, for some of you, you might leave something behind that caused you a lot, a lot of sadness. Let's see more loves. Six of Cups. Four of Swords. King of Pentacles and Three of Swords. Definitely you are moving from a situation here that really caused you a lot of sadness. Four of Swords, Three of Swords, this makes the Seven of Swords. You know, Seven of Swords is that you are getting away with something or try to get away with something. And whatever here is, you are moving away from a situation you are grounding yourself in a better way with this King of uh, Pentacles. And it's kind of like the next six months or in the next six months up to nine months, you are moving into the energy that you are actually belong. For some of you, you are moving on from a stagnant energy. Whatever that stagnant energy speaks to you. But let me clarify really quick. I feel a lot of healing is there. Having the, the temperance card. And the wheel of fortune. This is about also moving forward. You have Jupiter on your side. And Archangel Michael. That both two cards speaks about improvement tremendous improvement in your finances i feel also for some of you this improvements are happening because you are moving away from certain situation or even people people that didn't serve you actually were against you or against the actions were they were more bothering you to do certain things than you could do or help you there's a lot of swords swords definitely speaks about the the mental energy here and it's kind of like you are now connecting for some of you you felt quite disconnected with the divine but now the connection comes again the Four of Swords clarifier, please. Nine of Pentacles. For some of you, definitely here, you, you feel like you lost yourself in the way. 
and now you are recovering or you are recover the the good energy the nine the three of swords here having another five okay five of cups six of pentacles so we have five six and nine so definitely here whatever here you lost or feel you lost is not completely lost many many of you you are moving from a from a position where you felt underpaid or underestimated or or not really paid correctly so it seems here this recovery of yours happens quicker than even you think is gonna be for some of you you are in a field where is a lot of competition and not it's like you needed to learn why I feel here the disconnection because for some of you you thought everyone is good as you are but people were not quite there so you needed to learn certain things here how you can manage or how you can grow in this field of yours or in the field you are out there because I feel here you have more than other thing you do also whatever you do or whatever here you are moving towards not away but you're moving towards I feel here there is a lot of people will talk about you the only five missing is five of wands a lot of people will start noticing you it's kind of you coming out from a dark place yeah look at here look at here loves ace of pentacles for some of you loves you might leave a job that definitely here is supposed to pay you more it's hard to leave it but you know it's to the best okay this month also it's um, as we have the Mercury retrograde from the beginning of the month April 1st till April 24 25 you will rethink where I should be where I want to be because that's the the hermit energy and the nine of cups yes I know what I do but is this what I want to do I feel here you are very good what are you doing with the nine of pentacles and king of pentacles so it seems here for many many of you you are gonna change where you work or what you do or you are gonna start something or something here will start to pick up for you it's kind of like a rejuvenation what's the five of pentacles here seven of wands lovers and knight of wands what i'm feeling here <clears throat> there is a big awakening call for many sages and why is because for some of you why you were not appreciated because you were you would be taking like a beginner or again with the knight of wands here you were not taking seriously even as much as you fight for even though you are in a queen energy and then the king of pentacles here okay let me see here the five of swords what this is for the hierophant seven of cups ten of wands and two of swords there's something here you definitely could not see through for some of you you felt like there's no other better options than this or the companies you were looking they were not also it's like i feel here you you birthed your your ass here 
but there's other options here. Somebody here might told you there's no better options than than here or in our companies or things like that. But you know they are. Let's see here. What's the King of Pentacles? I also feel here this month is the month of um, could be you know the kind of month that either you feel at the crossroads or you feel at your pivotal moment in life. I need to make a change. I need to do something for me, not for them. I need to think of me first. And of course, as the Aries energy is there, also this net retrograde is in Aries. King of Pentacles, judgment. You know you are deserve more. But why for some reason you couldn't see it? I feel here, someone here come across you with this Knight of Cups and, and might offer you something and also pop up that question. Why are you not thinking to do this? Or why are you staying here? Then you can go there. It's like somebody here is... It's coming here and bringing you something. And it's kind of in an instant you will see whatever it is. But this person is just kind of like, you know, when some person is telling you, I'll meet you to that address and gives you a map and a circle, you figure out the road. So this person is just kind of like, you know, just suggesting something. Did you think to do this? Or did you think to go to that company? Or did you've been thinking of this? And I feel here you are very quick in, in your things. Look at this Knight of Swords. Like, yeah, I definitely can do. So your speed, it's quite, quite quick here. It's like there's something here like very quick understood. Because whoever I'm speaking today, the Sagittarius, you... You are definitely very strong, knowledgeable. We, we've we seen the Knight of Swords and we have the Knight of Wands and Knight of Cups. The Knight of Pentacles is it's the one missing here. We have the King of Pentacles. So you could consider yourself as a Knight of Pentacles one step at a time or you love consistency or love to be consistent. But I feel here you will not be seen the way you supposed to be seen. For some of you, you you always consider that hard work pays off. And somebody here is just kind of give you or opens to you a door to, to something else. That not the hard work, but the smart work or something else. They, they give you definitely here, it's, it seems here like, um, again, it's like um, a suggestion for something. Yeah, look at this. But you know, like, you know, feels like a dropping a bomb out there. If will explode, great. If not, still great, metaphorically speaking, I know. But for some of you, yes, somebody here is just kind of a feel like you you need to be taken in a different way to meet where you need to meet. For some of you, this is a very fortunate event or a fortunate person that will come across your path will stay or not doesn't matter but it's someone who will open up a portal or um, a door to you and definitely to a new beginning in your finances whatever you do for many many of you you could work for yourself for others of you 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 could be working for some com company but there's something here like you you love to work independently. You don't need a lot of people around you to do certain things. So there's something here about 
you you can do something and will be much easier on you and much happier what's this six of cups here for you loves because it seems here that for some of you could be even in five six months from now on you you might be in a whole different other energy yeah look at this eight of wands yes there's a lot of things here it's like will happen in could be eight weeks which is two months till up to six weeks that certain things here can change dramatically here it's kind of like um, a twist of your faith is gonna happening yeah moon it's it's even quite scary this uh, this energy here eight of cups and the Emperor <laughs> Wow three of Pentacles for some of you, somebody here might even, if you work, you know, for companies, but you work for yourself, somebody here might tell you, why are you not starting your own company? Why not starting working for you? Create your own company. Why you should look for other companies and break your back for them and they just take advantage of you and your expertise when you can do things on your own? Or why you not walk away from this to do you? Because look at here, loves. We've seen the Ten of uh, Cups at the bo bottom. We have the Five of Cups, Six of Cups, Seven of Cups, Eight of Cups, Nine of Cups. And we've seen the Ten of Cups at the bottom. So definitely here you are going to do something that definitely will make you happy. A new beginning that definitely will bring you that happiness you are looking or that satisfaction for you or live comfortably. It's kind of worth the effort you put it in. No kidding. What advice we have for you, darlings? Also, yet the five of wands is not out. We'll look for advice and if it's not coming in advice... We'll look in the deck but it seems here there is a, a new beginning here for many many of you with the full and ace of pentacles okay advice for sagittarius strength you definitely have quite expertise you definitely have some great experience on your arm on your back Whatever here you start, you're not starting from nothing. You're starting from experience here. Ace of Swords. You Also, for some of you, you might not be as young to start this, but you feel like this is the right thing to do. Ten of Swords. But something here feels very hard to let go. Probably mentally or emotionally. Seven of Swords. And we have a tower for you. Wow. Let the t this tower fall. Let this tower fall. Once this tower falls, Ace of Cups, Ace of Swords, Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Wands, within one week. Could be your fate could change in any time. Just letting go or quitting something. There's something here that it's it's coming but the way it's coming is looking dramatically or tragically for some of you even you feel like yes i'm um, i'm leaving this i work for five years or i'm i'm hearing for some of you you might be even fired but whatever here falls it's actually a blessing in the sky for your loves Look at this death. Oh, here you are, Ace of Wands. This is definitely a new beginning for many of you, loves. But this new beginning is not a joke. This is kind of... You, you, you are moving to, towards the, 
It's kind of the, the best you can see ever. Ten of Swords, Ten of Wands, we've seen the Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. You are moving towards your Ten of Pentacles. However, we do have the Nine of Pentacles. Let's see, the Five of Wands, where it is? I feel here you don't see this coming. Absolutely you don't. All right, let's see. Ooh, that's quite intense. <clears throat> the Five of Wands is right here. Page of Pentacles, Four of Pentacles. So you definitely have a new beginning here. Queen of Cups and the world. So whatever here is, it's kind of like allow it to go forward. Don't hold back. Because I feel here for some of you, you might very much hard holding on it. But you definitely have all these aces. This is kind of a breakthrough for some of you. Or for many. Wow. So let whatever here falls through to go away. Also, let me see where is the Ten of Pentacles for you here. Because we've seen it, but let's see. Oh, here it is. Whatever here comes new. Ten of Pentacles, we have the Chariot. For some of you, even whatever here you go or whatever new beginning here you have you are gonna go towards it or you are gonna need to move somewhere justice yeah you definitely are leaving something many many sad just leaving oh my goodness look at this six of wands definitely your victory your success your abundance so whatever here falling away let it fall out even though, yes, we, we all try to build certain things in this life, but some things might not be good for us for the long run. It's time for the change because fives also speaks about changes. So let the change come in. Wow, Sagittarius, probably definitely a great month but with some twists and turns that you probably don't expect. For some of you, there's also the, um, the full moon in Scorpio on the 23rd, I believe. That's when, when it's coming. And we are on the 23rd minute. Love and light, darlings. I hope you have a great month. Let us know how this resonates, speaks to you, or even connects with you. And... If you're part of this community, I thank you. If you're not, don't forget to connect, subscribe, like, and share. And definitely leave your feedback always. See ya, darlings. Bye for now.